Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we're back with the progress video number two today here on Crandall RSPS and we're not going to mess around, we're going to jump straight in and grab a Slayer task. The goal for this episode is at least 90 Slayer. 99 would be great but it's unrealistic, so I'm going to settle for 90, let's just, oh I'm still, uh, still got a Cockatrice task from uh, last episode. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed uh, the first episode. I certainly did enjoy it. I enjoyed making it. Like I said, this server is um, really fun for me and I will be doing a lot more videos. We're also probably going to do this clue scroll this episode as well. So um, I guess that's something to uh, look forward to. But yeah, I'll be back when I finish my current Slayer task. Okay, so I'm about to hit 85 Slayer, which means I'll be able to kill uh, Aberthal Demons. This is good because I can probably camp there for whips and uh, sell them off for, I think they're like 15 mil each. I'm not sure what the drop rate is. Uh, there's 85 Slayer. Yeah, I'm not sure what the drop rate is. I don't know if it's good or not, but um, we're going to give it a go once we're done with this task. Hopefully we can get uh, maybe at least at least one, let's be honest. At least one whip would be... Um, be ideal but yeah I'm gonna finish up this task and then we'll head over to uh, Abyssal Demons. I'm also going to be going to Necreals as well this episode and um, see if I can get myself a pair of D boots. If I can't I'll have to buy them off a player which um, might be a bit difficult because I haven't seen many people um, selling D boots. I've seen people trying to buy them but I haven't seen anyone um, selling them which is unfortunate so um, it looks like neck reels is going to be our best bet. Well, this is awkward. Alright, so I had no luck at neck reels trying to get my D boost. I must have killed about, I don't know, maybe 50. I didn't get a pair. So I thought, I may as well do my clue scroll. I uh, saw someone uh, posted on forums um, saying that I better be doing the clue scroll uh, in next episode. So um, we're going to get around to doing that. I'm going to be needing some assistance from forums, I do believe, because I have no idea uh, where this is. I um, have a rough idea, but I'm, just, I'm, I'm going to double check just to uh, confirm my suspicions. So, um, each um, clue, I guess, I'll um, show you what I'm doing and whatnot, so um, you uh, see that I'm actually doing it properly and not cheating in any way. So, um, yeah. Well, it's been about 10 minutes though, and I haven't found jack shit yet. I think my best bet at this point is just following the river, because that seems to be my biggest clue. Because if you look on the clue scroll, that's got to be a river, this bit here, and that must be a bridge. So, um, yeah, that's kind of my best bet, I'm thinking. That's my logic anyway. I'm just going to follow the river until I fucking find something. <laughs> there was another guy running about around here as well, but... Um, he didn't say much so yeah I'm a bit fucked at the minute because I have no idea where I'm going okay I'd like to give a shout out to Clifford because without him I would have had been here for fucking hours yeah I, I, oh nice man lost robe legs I thought it was going to be like a, uh, maybe like a five step clue but I guess not um, I got man lost robe legs uh, fire lighters and some runes I'm just showing what I've got. Okay, so clue scroll over. I've decided to uh, that I'm going to get started on range and magic in this episode. I'd realistically I'd like to hit 99 in both because they're the two skills that I don't like training much because it's just I don't know. I just find them annoying. So I'm just gonna get them out of the way, get them over and done within this episode. Hopefully. If I get to 99, I will be over the moon, so I don't have to touch them again, but, um, yeah, after that, we'll do our five barrows runs, and then I might get started on some wood cutting and fire making and or fletching, or maybe mining and smithing, I'm not too sure yet. I've also got a lot of charms, well, not, I say a lot, not many. It's a fair amount of charms in the bank, and I'm just sat here wondering, do I sell them to players, or should I use them to actually train summoning? Because I've seen people buying um, charms for like 100k each, and as you can see, I've got a fair few, so I'm going to make quite a bit of cash if I sell, um, I think it's just the green ones and the blue ones that were selling for 100k each. 
but um, there's still going to be a lot of cash, so I'm not sure if I sell them or use them for summoning. Um, hopefully I can make a decision before the episode ends, because I don't want to, uh, you know, sell them and then regret uh, not using them for summoning, and vice versa. So, uh, yeah, on to range and magic training. Okay, so I've come up with a little method on how I can train range and magic at the same time. I'm not in one range, so I don't know that uh, much further to go. But I'm only 60 magic, and obviously at uh, level 55 you unlock high alchemy. So what I'm doing, while I'm attacking rock crabs, I'm just alking mind runes. It's 8k XP per elk, and it doesn't interrupt with combat, so this is pretty much the perfect way for me to train both skills at once. Uh, obviously I don't like training either skill because as I said they I just find them annoying so um, hopefully this will shave uh, a lot of time off of my training. Hey we finally got a pair. Deep boots coming in nice. Uh, saves me about five mil there. That must have been my maybe my 70th kill, but we finally got a pair of D-Boots. I'm actually so hyped that we got a pair. I got a pair of Rune Boots before. I'm not sure if it's uh, the same drop rate or not, but um, yeah, we finally got the D-Boots. There it is, 99 range. We got to 86 magic as well. Uh, quite a bit off of um, 87, but uh, never mind. I'm actually going to head over to a pest control right now because uh, there's like 10 people there apparently, so... I'm going to get myself a pair of Barrow's Gloves and a Fighter Torso, I believe, uh, which will be quite nice and I can uh, upgrade from Rune. So yeah, I'll um, alert you all when some eventful happens. Okay, so everyone seems to have... <coughs> excuse me. Everyone seems to have had enough of Pest Control for now. So uh, I've got 45 points, so I can buy myself a Fighter Torso. I just can't get the uh, Barrow's Gloves yet. Um, which is unfortunate, I really would have liked those, but um, I don't mind too much. So we're going to out with the rune. I uh, just need to find the D-Legs. And... Boom. Now we look beast. I've always liked this. This has always been one of my most favourite looks on runes here. The D-Legs with the torso. Ah, progress, progress. I forgot to mention, I actually, uh, you actually get 175k per um, round of pest control you do, so I made 1.57k out of that, which is nice because it puts my cash stack up to 9.3 mil, as you can see. I don't know, I might clean my bank out a bit. I made uh, tabs for uh, farming and herb lore and obviously my charms tab. But I don't know, it's a very messy bank at the minute, so I might clean it out, um, or maybe I'll wait till I get a bit more few more items and then I'll do it but um, not too sure what I'm going to do right now I really want Barrow's Gloves to be honest so I might stay if um, other people are I think there's only like two people in the boat at the minute so there's not much point no everyone looks it looks like everyone's leaving so we'll, what Slayer level are we 86 Slayer we could probably get to uh, 90 Slayer this episode so um, yeah we're going to do that we're going to go home and grab our uh, Slayer task hopefully we can get something Decent, just see what we're gonna get live here. Yeah. Slime Master, I need the slime man. We'll do a hard task because, um, well, I've got uh, 72 prayer now, so it's pretty easy. Uh, a avian seeds, I think they're, I think I know what they are. I'm fairly certain I do, but I'll uh, be back with the next task. Oh, we almost escaped. Yeah, I just died by a uh, Mithril Dragon, I had like 2 HP, thought I'd risk it and try and tell you out, but uh, it didn't happen, as you can see. I don't know where my stuff's gone now, though. It's probably, because I teleported as soon as I died, so it's probably back at Mithril Dragons. I hope it is, because if it's not, that's just a lot of grinding to get back what I lost. Oh, in the process of looting back my stuff, I realised I got a hard clue scroll as a drop. So that's pretty dope. Uh, I'm going to finish off this task and then I'm probably just going to jump straight into the clue scroll. After that, uh, I'm going to do my five barrow chests. And I keep saying I'm going to do some of these diaries, but I never get around to it. So I'm definitely going to be doing some of these before uh, I end the episode. 
Hey, we did it. I told you all that I would get 90 slay before the episode ends, and we've just uh, we've just completed that uh, that goal. So I'm quite happy with that. I do not want mithril boots. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that. I can kill Dark Beast now, uh, even though I don't have any reason to. Not that I can think of anyway. So yeah, that's my first 90 skill that isn't a uh, combat skill. Oh, apart from... Um, Thieving. I am uh, really need to start working on some of these other skills because as you can see they are all one which isn't good so um, I'll probably get around to doing that in episode 3 or 4. Uh, I want to get 99 Slayer as soon as I can just for the game because it looks awesome. But uh, yeah after this I'm going to do this clue and then uh, achievement diaries like I said. Okay so this is the first spot I believe. Dig and find an item helping them you helping you on your treasure trail. This anagram reveals who to speak to next. Nod Med. Okay, time to refer to the uh, clue scroll guide. <laughs> we have found him. Talk to this guy. Oh, it's a puzzle box. You have to. I've never done one of these on actual RS, but you have to. I think that's corp. That looks like it should be corp. You have to like slide this thing and make a puzzle so I'll be back in like 10 hours Jesus Christ it took a while but we did it I'm just gonna check how long that took me I was recording it on the stopwatch on my phone <laughs> 28 and a half minutes to do that fucking puzzle box thing that was fucking A's to do fuck doing that again is this reward? this isn't even the reward oh, I don't buy the back of this that's him brother, he's a long way from home. Okay. Need to talk to brother Ahmed. Where is brother Ahmed? Brother Hamid, not Ahmed. Fucking retard, what are you doing? There he is. Another clue. This animal game reveals his bit. Prof loose, wrong pie. Okay, fuck this. Okay, need to talk to this guy. Yeah, I've been given an item. Fucking hell, how many times? How many of these do I need to do? L O. And talk to low. Another one. Okay, I know where that is. <sighs> Give me loot. Really? <laughs> All of that? For a fucking Zami page? Are you kidding me? Oh fuck! <laughs> fuck my life, get AIDS. Okay, now that that depressing clue scroll is out of the way, we're gonna move on to doing some of these achievement diaries. Kill 250 cows, pickpocket a man 50 times, switch magic books. Cool. <laughs> Join a clan chat. Small hundred button. Yeah, we're gonna get a bunch of these done. So um. Shouldn't take me too long, um, I'll just go get through them as fast as I can. Oh, that's cool, look at that little book thing on the screen there, I like that. It's just little things about this server that makes it special. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get through a bunch of these as quick as I can. Probably get all the easy one ones. Okay, maybe not all the easy ones. Uh, first chest of the video. Okay. Second chest of the video. Oh, what is this loot? Chest number three, I believe, coming up. Really? Like, really? Why are these loot so bad? Oh, two more, two more. Loot number four coming in. Oh. Oh, nice. Nice, I've already got the Derek's Plate body, but the, uh, I can't even, I'm not even going to try and pronounce that, that accuracy, maybe, I don't fucking know. Road top, that's nice, man. Decent. Sweet, one more chest after this. Dope. And the fifth and final chest of this video. Another Derek's Plate body, what the fuck? I've got three Derek's Plate bodies now. Well, I won't complain. I'm going to try and sell two of them. Um, probably keep, probably try and get a full Derek set. That'd be quite nice if I ever get around to PKing on this server. 
But um, yeah, that's going to be it for episode no uh, progress video number two. Hope you all enjoyed. We got a ton done in this episode. We got our new outfit uh, done. We got the uh, what's it called? Fire torso. Uh, I can't actually remember what we've what we've done this episode. I think we were close to getting various gloves, but um, not many people wanted to do pest control, so I didn't bother. Um, oh yeah, 99 range, 86 magic, 74 prayer, 90 slayer. So yeah, we did. Uh, we got a fair bit done. Uh, really enjoyed uh, making this episode, and hopefully you all enjoyed watching it. I uh, might be starting my Actually, I'll tell you what, if this video gets 50 likes, um, I will start making an Iron Man series on this server. So, 50 likes equals an Iron Man series. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.